Now, Storm Team 2 Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis with the Miami Valley's certified most accurate forecast. All right, this evening we're looking at our weather headlines. Muggy conditions again tonight. Lows low to mid 70s. Maybe just a slight drop in humidity. Slight drop in dew points may allow temperatures to get a little cooler than the last few nights, but not by much. Hotter Friday and Saturday. We're looking at mid to upper 90s expected. Uh, heat index net value still up around 100 or even a little bit above. Finally, thunderstorm chances go up as we get to Sunday. A cold front will be moving in. And we are going to see some relief behind that front on Monday, but we're right back to the low 90s on Tuesday, but then a little bit cooler after that toward Wednesday and Thursday. Forecast this evening, 89 at 7 o'clock with 85 at 9 p.m. 80 at 11, we'll have partly cloudy skies, only a very, very slight chance of a pop-up shower or thunderstorm. Also tomorrow, a very, very low chance, so it just basically looks like some heat up into the mid-90s there tomorrow afternoon. A heat advisory remains in effect all the way to Saturday evening, so keep that water intake up. Try to stay inside in the air conditioning late morning, afternoon, and into the early evening hours. We also have air quality issues again for Friday. Air quality alert has been issued for southwest. Ohio, most of Indiana, actually a good chunk of the Buckeye State too. Uh, air quality index forecast to be 101 ozone levels, and that is unhealthy for selected groups, heart uh, issues, uh, lung issues. Uh, already we're looking at some moderate ozone values this evening, 87, the uh, latest reading there and moderate. Live Doppler 2 HD, we're looking at the dry weather, but there have been some stronger storms up near Port Clinton, uh, the Toledo area too. Those are drifting east and northeast, so it could be a little active this evening. Up around uh, South Bass Island, Kelly's Island, with those storms progressing east along the Lake Erie shoreline. But the cooler weather staying north and west of us here still for the next several days. We'll drop off through the 80s, down to 80 at 11 o'clock, 78 at midnight, and then head down towards 73 at 6 a.m. But tomorrow afternoon, a little bit hotter than today, 94 Greenville, Sydney up to Bell Fountain, 95 in Troy. Looks like southern part of the Miami Valley here around Dayton up to about 96. 95 degrees in Eaton and uh, 94 in Springboro. Saturday afternoon, still looking at those temperatures well up into the 90s over our area. A Bryant Heating and Cooling Systems camera time lapse. We've seen more and more sunshine late this afternoon and evening, even getting back to partly to mostly sunny skies right now. And currently 92 in Dayton, a west northwest wind at 5 with a relative humidity down slightly from yesterday. Heat index right now at 97. Richard Lane in Greenville. 93 degrees. Marion Musser at 95 up in the Sydney area. Here's your forecast. Tonight, partly cloudy. It'll be muggy. 73 for the overnight low. Tomorrow, partly to mostly sunny, hot and humid and 96 degrees for the afternoon high. A light west wind could be close to a record high Saturday, 97. Thunderstorms likely on Sunday as that cold front moves in. A little cooler Monday and check out Tuesday morning mid 60s, but 92 in the afternoon. Another cold front brings a chance of thunderstorms Wednesday.